And we are back from our hike in Arnal Volcano. Uh, today we are going to draw this bird. Uh, there's two of them in the photo we took, but I'm just going to draw one of them. So let's start. Uh, just going to throw a circle or an oval there for the head. A uh, little triangle here for the beak going this way. Let's do a little another oval for the eye for now. Um, hoping I can keep this whole body on the drawing. Here, let's go ahead and let's see. I'm going to do a quick couple of shapes here. Let me do, let me do a little oval there, a couple of connecting lines. Let's see. So if I'm looking at the body, I'm kind of seeing two things here. We're seeing this kind of a rectangle kind of coming down here. And then I'm also seeing, I'm seeing kind of a oval here, which is the top of this wing. And then it almost is like a almost like an eye or an almond shape that kind of comes through here. So let's just sketch that in. And let's see, I probably want to do this a little more down. Okay. And then from here we've got, let's put in a couple of rectangles for the legs and then they're going to shoot this way. A couple more rectangles here. And then there's a branch that's going to go this way and it angles up a little bit and up a little more and then off to the right. Okay, and let's see, right about here, it kind of angles this way and then let's just take it down. Okay, so there's the branch that this bird is sitting on. Um, let's see here. So the foot, the toe to this leg is actually overlapping this leg. Um, so let me let's throw in a couple of circles here. I wanna, then I'm just going to connect these. And then there's a kind of a claw coming that way. Maybe another claw coming from the back. And this has got the little claw there. And I think, let me zoom in on my image here. Okay, yeah, so there's a toe coming out here. And that's got a claw. Okay, and then I think the next foot is starting right about here. So, a couple more circles, and we just connect those. And another little claw, you know, uh, at the end of that one. And let's do one more here. So, we've got. Try not to shake the camera too much. Okay. Uh, and there looks to be one more claw coming from the back side. So, I mean, it, all I'm really doing is a couple of half circles there. And... Thicken up the branch a little bit. And, let's see. All right, um, let's get, add the tail a little bit here. So um, let me just do a a 
All right, so this is basically a rectangle, um, but we're just kind of angling it a little bit and okay. Um, and I think that's about uh, getting off the board here a little bit. That's a doing all right for the basic structure of this bird. Um, so uh, let's see here. It's starting to rain. Hopefully it's not messing up my audio too much. So let's go back to the head. Um, and let's see here. So you can kind of see the feathers change color from here to here. So I'm just going to kind of put some of that line, some of that line work in here. Let's see. And uh, he's got a couple of feathers kind of sticking out. Um, Okay, the beak here is kind of hooking, hooking down here. Um, let's see. All right, then let's throw a that let's throw a little diamond here shape, and that'll be the nostril. Um, There's even a little bit of feathery action going on underneath the beak. Um, I think I drew the eye a little high, so I'm going to drop it, do another one. Okay, let's throw a little highlight here and a highlight here. The pupil, let's go ahead and just fill that in and let's, let's see here all right bump here and so from the leg here uh, to this point we got a little it's not a straight line it's a little bump there so let's just do that um, let's see here so this leg is kind of this looks like it's got pants on or something um, all right, Put a little shade in here. Camera's moving a little, a little bit. Let's see if I can't. Okay. Um, so let's see this leg. They're pretty much just straight lines. Um, and I've drawn these two legs a little further apart than they are in the photo, but uh, I think it'll be all right. So I'm not going to move them. And let's just do that. Um, flesh out these claws a little better. You can kind of see how the knuckles, you know, it's almost like a perfect ball here on all of them. 
So I'm just kind of going around the ball here and here. Um, okay. I probably should be doing this with my thicker pen. Um, but I'm not quite ready to switch over yet. All right. Um, so I don't want to draw too many feathers, but there's definitely some ruffling or whatever you want to call it kind of going through here. So let's get that in there. Um, and then we've got these, it's like an orange section right here. It's going to get some detail, so I'm just going to try and get that in. Um, and then I'm probably just going to eyeball a few. A couple of feathers here, nothing. I don't want to do too much. Um, okay. And then we get down, so I'm kind of making some of this up right here, but once we get down to this portion of the tail, okay, then it's almost like we've got layering going of some of the feathers, so try and represent that without going into too much detail um, detail on the tail alright so I'm just gonna try and put a little texture in here uh, some cross hatching and Um, it's looking all right. Uh, I want to do some lines in here to kind of just flesh out this chest portion. And you can kind of see, uh, see, so I always have trouble deciding how many feathers I want to put in. So I'm kind of just looking for the the shadows and trying to match some of the darker spots that I'm kind of seen in the photo because uh, it can get tricky and start looking like scales I, th I think sometimes and so you want to be careful careful of that um, all right I think at this point I'm gonna switch to my thicker pin here kind of see some color change here in the face so I like to just kind of sketch it in just a little darker here and a little lighter here um, as far as the feather colors are okay uh, let me switch pins real fast and I want to flesh out a little bit of the tree a little better up some of the legs
Okay, uh, I think I think we're pretty good. I'm gonna add a little shadow underneath the feet here, just to make them pop a little bit. I'm just gonna darken these up because uh, they're on the back side here, and. Little detail here on the on the branch, and take one last look here. Uh, I think it's looking pretty good, so that'll probably do it. Uh, thanks for joining me today. If you want to see my superhero graphic novel, please go to trepcomic.com. I will see you next time here on Hike Fine Draw. Thanks.